Hello there. <laughs> oh my gosh, hi! We're back at the usual setup, which is in my guest room. We are on the final week of the Korean 11 abs challenge. And as always, all this information is being referenced by a YouTube channel called Unmi. And here's a YouTube video of it. Okay, so for this week, we're finally gonna do four sets of these. So that is a one set increase. Between each set, we're gonna have one minute break. And then in between each move, we're gonna have a 30 second rest. The first one are leg raises, and she says to do more reps than previous weeks. In my case, I'll do like maybe 15 to 20. The second one are toe touches. You gotta do between 20 or 30 reps. The third ones are V-ups. You do 10 reps of those. Fourth are seated bicycle twists, and you're gonna do those 10 times. The final workouts are planks, and then you just do that for however long you can do it for. The minimum should be 30 seconds plus though. Lastly, for the diet routine, it's going to be up to you in terms of how you can pick the diet routine that was done in the first week or the one that was done between the second and third week. Everything will be linked down below to remind you guys what that is. TMI. I woke up today with a lovely uh, lady surprise. There was a lot of it. Luckily, it didn't stay in the bed, but now my pajamas are ruined. But yeah, that was not a pleasant thing to wake up to. So sorry if I look sour because of it. I don't know if I'll have mood swings. Usually I am pretty normal. Let's get on to the boom. finished the workout and I did not realize that toe touches are a pain in the butt. <laughs> I didn't think I would uh, struggle so hard to do that type of workout because in the video it looked so easy but I was very very wrong about that proportion. Good news is, is that my planks have gotten so much better and I can't believe I'm saying this but I prefer planks over those stupid toe touches. <laughs> Can you tell that I'm so happy that I can do planks now. Other than that, I am going to continue to learn favorite loka. Shall we dance? Let's go dance. <laughs> These watermelons are the sweetest watermelons I've had. So the bunny apples are back. Because they're not as sweet as I would like them to be, I'm gonna dip into something that you guys might have never heard before, but it's a Vietnamese thing, and it's called shrimp salt. And it helps make it sweeter. I know, but it tastes good. You can't judge it until you've tried this, okay? <laughs> weird update but the chicken salad that I just ate had avocado in it and it's the first time I've added avocado before I just had the avocado by itself and then with the chicken because I thought it'd be heavy today I decided to add the avocado just to get some healthy fats in me I can't believe I'm saying this because it is a rarity I got full from that <laughs> because I'm doing this diet I think my stomach has shrunk 
Hello. I still hate toe touches. It hurts the upper part of my abs a lot. I also noticed that my stomach looks bloated. Even though I've been doing the same diet, I believe I'm getting bloated due to me being on my period. I don't know what's going to happen as a result by the end of this week because my period will end on the Friday. Seeing the 11 abs are looking grim. But I don't care. I'm still feeling myself to the point where I'm feeling a bit sexy. <laughs> I'm going to learn a new choreography. This is a throwback song and because that i'm feeling myself <laughs> i'm going to be learning aoa heart attack this is the very first song that i discovered aoa and ever since that era i've been loving their music i'm going to learn aoa heart attack let's get it <laughs> Gifted us jackfruit. finished my first zoom tutorial lecture thingy i've used zoom once for a um a club meeting not like a ooh, ooh type of club it's a university club okay I, I don't party okay yeah the zoom lecture was supposed to be from six to nine but obviously ended early because it's just an introduction but i am going to eat my dinner now i am starving <laughs> something wrong with me uh, today you can't tell right now but i will show you this eye right here um the eyelid is swollen like you see how the crease is not as thick as so this is how my eye usually looks but for some reason it's got swollen i don't know why i've never had this happen before like it hurts to touch it it's not painful it's just like it feels different it does hurt yeah i don't know how to cope with this I, I don't know. seen this ever and it's strawberry and cream flavor so I'm gonna try it out okay taste test, taste test. Mm. I recommend <laughs> a 
reflection journal of this journey of me doing the Korean Lumen Abs challenge. First off, this eye has gotten worse. It's gotten a bit more swollen and every single time I blink, it's more noticeable in terms of the little pain signals that I've been receiving from them. In the result, you can tell that I did not achieve the Korean 11 abs. First off, I'm still a bit bloated from having my period. My period did end today, but I still look bloated, but not as bloated as when I was on my period. Another factor that I didn't think I would get them is because me having flour for a few times, which is like the pho and the spring rolls. Maybe it was the cardio that I'm doing. I mean, I did dance for over an hour, which should have been enough cardio, in my opinion. Maybe it wasn't enough. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, there's, there's probably like a multitude of factors that could have resulted in me not getting the Korean Lemon abs. The last factor that I can think of is that for her, she was able to get those abs. The way she was before she started the challenge was very different from mine. I have a lot of fat. I was more self-conscious about my abs and my thighs. Before Unmi started the challenge, she just looked bloated. She didn't have a lot of fat. That's why I believe she was able to get the Korean Lemon abs. Whereas for me, I had a lot of fat and then bloatedness. So it was like a two for one. Great, Anna. My body's amazing. <laughs> so yeah, I feel like that's the reason why I couldn't get the Korean Lemon abs. Because I wasn't at the body state that she was in. But overall, I don't regret doing the Korean Lemon abs challenge. It has definitely changed the way I look at my own lifestyle. I feel like I'm able to work out even if I had school. So I can envision that for the future. I thought that I was always too busy, but I realized I also procrastinated a lot. <laughs> to avoid procrastination, I should put the workout time in that slot. This is not the end of my Korean 11 abs journey. I will continue to look at her other videos that focus on the abs to hopefully achieve those goals eventually. <laughs> I will continue to eat less proportions of my meals. I don't know if I'll incorporate flour, and if I did, it's probably because of, you know, pho and things. If you guys did join me on this Korean Lemon abs journey, and if you got those abs, yes. And if you didn't, I'm just telling you that it's okay. It's okay that you didn't. Do you feel stronger? Do you feel better? Do you love yourself more? Because I feel all those things. I love myself more. I feel more happy. I feel more toned out. I feel stronger. My goal is to get stronger, specifically my stamina. My stamina sucks, like I told you from the very beginning. And now I'm happy to say that it's working. And again, I told you guys how I'm doing this for the long run and it's looking bright. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed um, this journey that you had with me. It's been hard. Sometimes I wanted to give up. Sometimes it looked grim, but I didn't give up and you shouldn't either, okay? Even if you weren't at the state that the model was in or the state that I was in and you still want to achieve those goals, do it. <laughs> Get those goals you want. Whatever makes you happy, just do it. <laughs> I have never said this ever in my vlogs, but I guess I'll do it now. <laughs> follow my Instagram. Oh, if you do follow my Instagram, I might do some updates on my abs if you guys would like that i will continue to work out i'll let you know what videos i'm doing to be like hey i'm doing this video this is the result bam abs <laughs> something like that you can feel, feel free to like and subscribe i'll think about what other contents i should post on my youtube video but that's a me problem you guys want to help me it's okay i'm a content creator i need to like think of content <laughs> that is the end of this video so bye bye